salvation, I looked up salvation in the Greek, soteria. And the way you get that word from the derivative was soter. And that was an actual person that, or a, a deity or something that would be a savior, a deliverer, or preserve, preserver. So the word salvation, they give context clues, would be deliverance preservation safety we all kind of know what salvation is so that means to go what is well what's that word in the end of psalms salvation what does that mean in the hebrew well this is where it blew my mind is it trans the transliteration and phonetically how we say it salvation in hebrew means yeshua and it's there it is it so y e s Yes, 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 but Y-E-S-H-U-A-H, Yeshua, how you would say Jesus' name in Hebrew. Exactly. Before Jesus is ever walking on earth. Right. So if you go into the Jesus in Yahoo, uh, in, in Hebrew, if you're looking up his literal name from the Greek, it's Yehoshua, Yehoshua, which is Jehovah is salvation. So basically, it's saying... Full circle. Salvation is salvation. Or, yes, full circle, or or Jehovah is Jehovah, either mm -hmm. way, you know, like from the Greek to the Hebrew. But then I went on a little, little bit further, mm -hmm. and every time in the Old Testament, nearly every time, and I haven't caught it, it either, when it says the Lord God, or like David was talking to the Lord, it's either one of two words, it's either Hebrew word, Yehovah, uh -huh. or it's Adonai. Adonai. Mm -hmm. And that translates to Lord or Yahweh, which is the sacred name to the Jews. The right. name that can't be said. It can only be read through four, later, through four letters, but they don't know how to, no, no man knows how to Pronounce. say it. That's what the, you know, that's what the, the story is. Mm -hmm. um, a little more digging on that. But just one thing real quick. Yehovah comes from the derivative of the Hebrew word Haya, which is H1961, and it means to be, to become, or come to pass. And this was just like in the beginning of John, the word, in the beginning was the word, the right. word was God, and the word was with God, and the word became flesh and dwelt among us. So that right there, by definition, that by definition confirms that his name, his name bears witness to the prophecies. Right. Before... It's just it's amazing. And then you have Isaiah 7, 14, and it's Emmanuel. You, you should call him his name Emmanuel, which translates to God, God is with, with us. us. So, like, I, just with this information today, I, could, I don't, just sharing it, I feel like it's so amazing that we can prove out through the yeah, word of God. That's right. The word of God. Yeah. And so, and, oh, and guess what? The best part about the whole thing is all of these derivative translations. Yeah come from one single word that means to save. Yep, to look save at is that. To save the derivative of all the Yeho Yeshua. And if you've got to ask a simple kid that went to any Bible class, who's the one that saves? The, what's the name going to be? Jesus. Jesus. It is just a, it's perfect and amazing. I don't have to share that. It's, Thank you awesome. very much.